I'm gonna start here on the first baseline. I'm gonna count every ball in the dirt. I am an expert boredom time killer. Don't tell me you've never sat in a classroom and counted specks in a ceiling tile. I've done it a lot, so this is right up my alley. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. They won't have time to count the balls one by one, so the key to solving this challenge will be breaking the field into smaller sections. Take a look at the field. How would you divide it up to get the most accurate count? Does the size matter? The shape? There is a trick some of you baseball fans might know. Here's a hint. What's the distance between the bases of a standard baseball diamond? And how many of those squares do you think fit in the whole field? If I told you that I put 340 balls in this square, could you do the math? The outfield is going to be the hardest section to tackle. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get a really accurate count of the infield, and then I'll move to the outfield. My strategy today is I'm going to first tackle the infield. Then I'll divide the outfield by zone and multiply by three. All right, let's just look around and see what we It was really here. obvious real quick that you're not going to have enough time to count all the balls within the time frame. So what I wanted to do was to count the infield and then count half the outfield and just double that number. Two, two, three, four, five, six. So it looks like both Randy and Terry are counting the entire infield. That could work, but that's a lot of counting to get done in 30 minutes. What they need to do is to find a small area and extrapolate. This is how they determine how many galaxies are in the universe. NASA's Hubble Space Telescopes have photographed a small section of the night sky, containing about 5,500 galaxies. By approximating how many similar sections of the sky there are, scientists estimate the number of galaxies in the universe to be over 100 billion. There aren't quite 100 billion baseballs here, but I'm eager to see how Randy and Terry will solve this challenge. We create challenges designed to outwit each other. Ooh, boy. Take it easy, big guy. My IQ ranks me in the top 2% of the population. I don't like the title of genius, but I'm probably the smartest guy in the room. I'm the smartest guy in the room.